dealing with some crazy folk now, you don't know what you're dealing with. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. It's that demon within them. Amen. And so, therefore, you, your light shine. Amen. Oftentimes, they challenge you and do things intentionally to hurt you. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Leaders. Amen. Folk that are saved, sanctified and filled with God's Holy Ghost. Amen. In the passage of scripture, it speaks, amen, symbolically of a dove. And oftentimes you will find out through the scriptures, amen, that we as saints, amen, we are equated symbolically with animals and other things. Amen. Such as sheep and goats and wheat and tares, even fish. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, amen, told his disciples, it says, Behold, I send you forth as sheep. Yes, amen. amen. In the midst of wolves. Yes, yes, amen. Be wise as servants yes, and harmless as doves. John, in the Gospel of John 1 and 32, said that he saw the Holy Spirit come down in the shape of a dove. And then, hallelujah, that same Holy Ghost yes. that came down in the shape of a dove dwell in you and I. Yeah. Amen. So therefore, what happens when doves cry? When you that are possessed Amen with this Holy Ghost. Uh -huh. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. David, amen. I don't know what he was going through, but he must have been in some far place uh, to himself. And he must have saw a dove. And amen. He said, Oh, that I had wings of a dove. Then when I fly away and be at rest. Thank you, Jesus. Indicating that he was hurt. Yes, sir. And he was tired of being hurt. Yeah, yeah. Amen. Glory to God. And he was frustrated. Yes, Amen. And, 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 and this happens oftentimes. For I heard Jeremiah in Jeremiah 9 and 1. Amen. When he was going through his situation, he found himself crying all night long. Yeah. He said, oh, For the slain of the daughter of my people. Yes, sir. He continued to say, Oh, that I, I had in the wilderness a lodging place yeah. of wayfaring men that I might lead my people. I just feel like I gotta get away. Yeah. I gotta get away. I just gotta get away from this madness. I got to get away. I'm tired of being hurt. I'm tired of this frustration. I just got to get away. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. Amen. I want you to understand, amen, that, that the leader, amen, often feels that they got to get away because, amen, the leader, amen, cannot be really caught crying. Because the leader, amen, is the symbol of strength. Amen. He's the symbol of stability yes, and of power and wisdom. Uh -huh. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. And sometimes, amen, even in your home, sometimes you cannot share what you're going through with your spouse. Oh. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Glory to God. Well, for oftentimes, it might be the spouse. That's causing the problem. Oh, amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Maybe she can't tell him. Because maybe he can't handle it. Oh, yeah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Maybe he can't tell her because if he tell her about what he's going through, it might make her look at that other person differently and treat them differently. Yeah. So he sits on it all by himself. The leader of an auxiliary cannot share everything. Uh -huh. The woes and the dis 
sought the Lord three times. And after a while, he tells us in 2 Corinthians 12 and 9, he heard the Lord say that my grace is sufficient for thee, for my strength is made perfect in weakness. Hallelujah. In other words, amen, God shows himself strong in times of your weakness. So Paul said, therefore will I take pleasure in my infirmities, in my persecution and distresses. For Christ's sake, for when I am weak, then I am strong. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. See, see, in these times we find out that we can't lean upon our own strength. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. But David said it this way. Uh -huh. Amen. In Psalm 61 and 2, he said, When my heart is overwhelmed, then I go to the rock. Hallelujah. The rock that's higher than I. He said, Thank you, Jesus. See, that's what, amen. Even, amen, when you look at the bird, amen. The little bird, the eagle, well, at the time when he traveled from a distant land, glory to God, he has to land somewhere. He has to find a place of security. 